Supervisors in Marin County declared a state of emergency last night in response to the parade of powerful atmospheric rivers we've seen all over the Bay Area. Justin Andrews is live in Larkspur this morning for us. And Justin, I know you were saying concerns for future flooding. What's going on with this? Well, yeah, that flooding is the concern this morning. That's also why on last night, the uh, Marin County supervisors, they voted to declare a state of emergency because they fear that flooding. But this is all to help them get extra costs from the state and also federal funds to help pay for the damages that we've seen over these last storms. And let me tell you, the damage is pretty widespread, really across the Bay Area, but specifically here in Marin County. Here's video from yesterday in Nevada where a tree crashed onto this home. And if you look at the video here, it's a pretty massive tree and it took out a good chunk of the home. There's some damage to this house. We also saw flooded streets, mudslides, coastal erosion, fallen trees, power lines, pretty much any damage you can think of, we've been seeing it. Stinson Beach got battered the hardest, according to the county here in Marin, where 22 buildings were left damaged and another 45 structures had water damage to it. Keep in mind, some of these could be homes. Marin County Fire Chief says there's about 15 to 20 million dollars in damages. And also think about this. The assessments are still ongoing, so that number could potentially rise. County leaders say that they expect more rains, although they don't expect them to be just as strong as what we've seen over the last several days. But they are prepared and they will continue monitoring the water levels and monitoring the damages that they're seeing throughout the county to see if they need to assess or change anything as they move forward. I'll send it back to you. All right.